Hello and welcome to another SOR product introduction. Today we are happy to announce the launch of our newest product, the 1100 series magnetic level indicator. But before we get too far into the specifics of the 1100 series, let's go over some of the basics for those who may not be familiar with the operation of a magnetic level indicator. Magnetic level indicators, or sometimes called magnetic level gauges or bypass level indicators, and they're designed to provide a visual indication of the process liquid level within a larger primary process vessel. A magnetic level indicator, or MLI, is typically made up of three primary components, the chamber, the float, and the indicator. The chamber and the float are specially selected per application to ensure maximum performance under exact process conditions. In addition, the float also houses a magnet on the inside that is perfectly paired to work with the indicator. And the indicator assembly contains a series of rotating flags or flippers that are designed to rotate as the float moves up and down, which indicates process level. So once we put them all together, how does it work? Well, the entire assembly is then attached to the primary process vessel via the process connections. A side-side connection style is shown here in our example. As the vessel is filled, the process fluid flows into the MLI chamber through the lower process connection and rises at the same rate and level as the primary vessel. As the liquid rises, the float with the magnet inside is pushed up inside the chamber at the same rate as the fluid. As the float rises, the magnet inside the float interacts with the indicator that is attached to the outside of the chamber and causes the flags to rotate. Again, this interaction happens through the chamber wall and is a completely non-invasive process. As these flags rotate, the color displayed changes from white to red and provides a visual and dynamic representation of the process level. One of the benefits of this type of design is that the magnet inside of the float can easily be used to drive other devices or instrumentation attached to the outside of the chamber, such as point level switches or even level transmitters. So let's take a look at a few examples of how the 1100 series indicator is used. Historically, one of the primary applications for magnetic level indicators has been as a replacement for older sight glass level gauges. These products were once the dominant method to indicate liquid level and they continue to be used in industry today, but have become less popular over the years since they have been known to leak or become unreadable over time. Many customers have found that they can reduce risk and increase performance by replacing these products with MLI technology. Another benefit to MLI technology is the ability to use the 1100 series as an instrumentation bridle. SOR can easily provide secondary chambers, ancillary equipment, or even additional instrumentation to the 1100 series, making it the central location for all of your process measurement. This design flexibility allows users to eliminate complexity and requires fewer process vessel connections. Besides these specific applications, there are literally hundreds of other applications in several different industries where MLI technology is currently used. Basically, if level measurement is required, it's a good bet that the SOR 1100 series magnetic level indicator will be right at home. Now let's take a minute to talk about a few of the features and benefits you get when ordering an 1100 series indicator from SOR. Like we discussed earlier, the 1100 series indicator is made up of three critical systems, the float, the chamber, and the indicator. Each has their distinct advantages. The float design SOR uses is a float similar to the ones used for decades on our mechanical level products. The difference is that the weight of the magnet must also be taken into consideration, and this means that special care must go into selecting float characteristics specific to each application. Again, our experience is a tremendous asset in this regard. Another benefit to our design is that SOR includes both top and bottom float protection springs as standard in every 1100 series indicator. For the chamber, SOR has again relied heavily on our experience 
this time building pressure vessels for the power and oil and gas industry. Schedule 40, 316 construction is standard, but other schedules and materials are readily available, and all are designed to ANSI B311 and B313 guidelines. Another benefit unique to SOR is the ability to offer dimensional drawings at the time of quotation. Now, this can be a real time saver for the customer and allows them to begin planning out the system design well in advance. The indicator is another place where SOR has drawn on industry accepted designs. Indicators are available in measured ranges from 6 inches to 20 feet as standard, but we can go longer if necessary. Highly reliable operation and 200 foot viewing distances mean that the 1100 series indicators will be ready whenever you need them. Now let's quickly go through what information will be necessary when ordering your 1100 series indicator. When requesting a quote, you will be asked to provide a number of process specifications in order to ensure that the right product is quoted. Examples of some of the information we will need are maximum pressure, maximum process temperature, process specific gravity, the chamber material needed, the chamber type and configuration. Now, examples of this would be things like the chamber with a flange on top, a flange on bottom, a sealed top and bottom, and many more. The process connection type and configuration. Examples of this might be connections on the side side or side bottom, etc and center to center dimension. Be sure to think about any additional certifications or options you may also need. SOR can supply most any option you might need with your indicator, so be sure to let us know and we can include items such as NACE certification, interface measurement, point level switches, temperature or pressure measurement devices, and many more. When you have all of your information ready, then the first step is to download and fill out an SOR 1100 series application data sheet for each unit. You then send these forms to your local SOR representative or directly to SOR Inside Sales. A quotation should be compiled and sent back to you within five working days for most applications. After that, the only thing left at that point is to place the order. Once again, SOR is very excited to offer the 1100 series magnetic level indicator to our customers. With features like standard chambers designed to meet ANSI B311 and B313 guidelines, dimension drawings available at the time of quotation, we are confident that we can differentiate ourselves in the industry and we are anxious to prove it. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you have any questions about the 1100 series magnetic level indicator or any other SOR products, please visit SORinc.com or contact your local SOR representative. Thanks again.